When you migrate to WeKeep, you'll likely have customer invoices or vendor bills that are still outstanding. The balance of these outstanding invoices and bills need to be imported into WeKeep as opening balances for your customers and vendors respectively. In order to have accurate balances of your accounts receivable and accounts payable and keep track of the amount of money that your customers still owe you and the amount that you still owe your vendors. So let's see how you can set up your customers' opening balances. Your vendors' opening balances are treated similarly. Before we proceed, make sure you've migrated your contacts first. To learn how to do that, check out our other videos on that topic. Suppose you've decided that you will be issuing invoices and recording customer payments in WeKeep starting from the 1st of January. To set up the opening balances of your customers, you'll need to import all your unpaid invoices as at the 31st of December. Let's see how to prepare your invoices CSV file. First, download the invoices template from WeKeep by going to Invoicing in the left side menu, then click on Import. Click on the link to download the CSV template. Recall that our goal is to import only the balances of your outstanding invoices, not the invoices amounts. In your spreadsheet, make a list of these invoices and their balances. To import the invoice balance only, set the quantity to 1 and make sure that the price equals the balance amount. The statuses of these invoices should be set to sent. Finally, for the account column, instead of choosing an income account such as sales like you typically do when creating an invoice, choose the opening balance offset account because our goal is to record the opening balance for that invoice only. Now, you can import that file into WeKeep and map each column of your CSV file to WeKeep's columns. Now that we've imported the invoices, let's have a look at a couple of reports to verify opening balances. Go to Reports in the left side menu, then click on the Statement of Account tab. To see each of your customer's accounts receivable balance, filter your report by your customer's name and set the date to filter to the 31st of December to get your customer's accounts receivable opening balance on the 1st of January. As you can see, each of the customer's accounts receivable opening balances on the 1st of January match the balances from the CSV file. If you remove the contacts filter, you can see that the imported invoices increased your account's receivable total balance by the total amount they owe you as at the 1st of January. This change in your account's receivable opening balance is also visible in your balance sheet. A final note. Notice that we haven't applied any tax rates to the invoices. This is because any taxes due must be migrated separately as part of setting up the opening balance of other accounts. Check out our other videos covering that topic.